Ways Your Website Can Get Hacked, Part 6. Let's talk about backups. Now you might be thinking backups are supposed to save me from a website hack so that I can restore a website. How can a backup be a root cause for a hack? The actual problem isn't backups. The actual problem is unencrypted backups. Now think about this. If somebody wanted to hack your website, they have to do a lot of tricky stuff to get into your site and gain access. But what if instead of doing all of that, they just get access to one of the backups, which is unencrypted. In that case, they don't have to hack your website because all the data they need is already in the backup. Usernames, passwords, information, payments, user info, everything else is already in the backup. And that's the this with unencrypted backup. If hacker gets access to your backup, they have everything they need. They don't need to hack your website. So let me show you how to encrypt your backups so this problem goes away. So to encrypt your backups, you can use a plugin like Duplicator Pro. It has a security feature where you can encrypt your backup. Let me show you. So this is the basic dashboard of backups. You see, I already have a backup. Let me create a new one by going to add new. And you'll see some default settings, the backup name, template, storage options. And in the backup option here, you can always go to security and choose the archive encryption option. This is where you enter a password for example, I'll just type some random letters here, typing on my keyboard, and this will encrypt the backup. Now, do keep in mind that the password you set is very important. So make sure to save it in a password manager because if you lose the password, the backup is completely useless. You cannot use it without the password. But the benefit of this encryption is that you can keep it on your server, you can keep it in local drive, you can keep it anywhere. If anybody gets access to the backup, they won't be able to open it and get data out of it. So the next time you take a backup, make sure to encrypt it using Duplicator Pro and follow me for more website security tips.